Once a teacher of mine, when I was very young in age, he took me in his car and he said, Walid, I want to take you to the place in our city where it has more potential than any other place in our city. It has potentials to make billions of dollars. It has a potential to change the world. It has a potential to cure so many diseases and to solve so many problems. So I'm thinking, where are we going to go? University? Or research centers? Or, I don't know, big companies? A news outlet? What, what is it going to be the most resourceful place in our city? And he took me to the cemetery. And it's like, cemetery? What potential people have in the cemetery? He said, inside these graves, there is ideas worth billions of dollars. In these graves, there is so many talents and potentials beyond your imagination. But what happened to it? It was buried with the people who had these talents and ideas and, and potentials. They never utilized it. They never used it. He said, don't ever let your talents and your potential to be buried with you. Make sure that you exercise it before you go to your grave. These talents and these potentials and these abilities that Allah have given you, these potentials that Allah said to the angels, Inni a'lamu ma la ta'lamun. I know about human beings what you don't know. The abilities that Allah have given you as a human being beyond your imaginations. But the problem is we never discover it. We never utilize it. And it's never been too late. So many of us blessed with so many things, but unfortunately, we don't feel the trust and the self-esteem to use it. These are gifts from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to you. What you do with it is your gift back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.